Member James, do you have anything you want to add? So, just to, let me just reiterate, these are best models that have been used elsewhere. These are not pie-in-the-sky suggestions, but um, these are recommendations that have been put forth in other locations where they have had uh, readers and stadiums. And so, we would urge uh, EFCC to uh, incorporate them into uh, their transportation management plan. And let me just say that with regards to um, regulating alcohol and the alcohol license, there are, as you know, community boards, two and six are having some meetings, and um, Far City Ratner has agreed to meet with elected officials. I'm sure ESDC and Far City Ratner will say, well, there's a task force, there's a meeting usually in the evening with the residents, but usually at these meetings, they talk at each, we talk at each other, we don't talk with one another. And all that we are asking for is cooperation um, and asking for uh, that uh, uh, Barclays uh, serve as a good corporate neighbor um, in the city of New York, and we thank you for your attention. So we've been joined by uh, State Senator of Belmont at Montgomery. Thank you very much, Senator Montgomery. Uh, well, we are here uh, to uh, try once again to support the citizens that we represent in this community. We are people who live here, uh, have not asked for this, uh, this development, it's not wanted wasn't asked for, it doesn't really help our community, and it's brought a tremendous amount of stress on the citizens who live here. So what we're supporting is that at least, in the least, our residents who live here, who will have to live with forever and ever the consequences of this development, some protections for them. So that's simply what we're asking, and I'm very grateful to my council member uh, for putting forth uh, an, an effort, and I certainly support it in Albany, uh, to provide some level of relief and protection for the citizens who actually live in this community 24-7. So thank you.